Hi guys, this is Joe from Techie Lobang. Welcome back to this channel. Today will be a very quick unboxing on this U Green Gen Fast Charger. So they approached me to ask me if I would like to review a fast charger for my laptop. Of course, I say yes because everybody needs a Gen Fast Charger. I think uh, if you are having a modern or a latest laptop normally it will be supported by this USB-C charging and if you are supported by this USB-C charging definitely I think a fast GAN charger will be the way to go for this case I have with me this U-Green GAN fast charger and it is based on the 100 watt so in the market you might have seen 65 watt 100 watt 200 watt etc so for for a simple for a simple gen charger right now i think it is better that you get the 100 watt version and this is a very affordable version because um looking at the price over here let me put the price over here you know that it is super affordable for having another extra charger for your laptop at a very affordable price and without further ado let me open it out that is the U green gen charger so not only that it comes with the USB-C port over here you can see over here let me uh, zoom in and light brighten the video so that you can see properly for example over here you has USB-C1, USB-C2, USB-C3 and USB-A so what it means that you can use this charger to charge up your devices for example if you have a 65 watt laptop you can use it on one of the ports over here and the rest of the ports you can use it for maybe your your ipad or, or whatever or your your tablet your phone and over here usb a you can also charge on other things you are using usb a so okay i hope you can see it with my very stable hand so usb c1 and c2 the output is 5 volt 3 ampere or 9 volt 3 ampere or 12 volt 3 ampere or 15 volt 3 ampere or 20 volt 5 ampere or 3.3 to 21 volt 3 ampere basically the usb c1 and c2 are capable for 100 watt maximum output usb c3 is basically 5 volts 3 ampere 9 volt 2.5 ampere 12 volt 1.88 ampere 3.3 to 5.9 volt 3 ampere basically to cut this short 22.5 watts maximum and usb a the output is actually 4.5 volt 5 ampere or maximum output of 100 watt which is quite amazing i should say so yeah that's about it in terms of this charger i mean the specs of this charger so you can see that this is actually quite a slim looking charger but do note that if you buy this charger it doesn't come with any cable and um, to make full use of the 100 watt it, you have to be careful about the choice of the cable that you need to use especially for charging a, a laptop you have to make sure that it is capable to support this kind of uh, PD delivery charging okay to give you an example this is one that is capable to do PD charging at 100 watt or even more okay these are the this is how it looks like you can actually um, get hold of in part of the U green product you might also be able to see it over here if you are allowed to travel in future 
you might be able to make full use of just one simple charger to charge your devices so i believe um, normally maybe for me i have two phones always by myself or uh, for myself and one laptop or one or two laptops and and i think this is sufficient for me this is the eu port it's a two pin plug not a three pin but a two pin just just take note that you need to buy a cable in order to use this GAN charger right now i'm going to test out this charging capability of the u green GAN smart charger i will want to use my own laptop okay this is the timpad x1 yoga so without further ado let me power no let me plug in this first can see it is already power on so i just need to power on like this and the cable i just need to plug it in this is a usb c on both sides so i just need to select the top one so you can see from this laptop it is currently charging so let me zoom in so that you can see clearly usually i'll use a 65 watt charger for this laptop but then uh, this is the 100 watt this is a 100 watt charger so it's more than enough to charge it and you can see that the charging speed is actually quite fast 39 minutes until fully charged so yeah i will have to wait a while to see how it charge but do remember that if you have a vertical adapter like this setup you will notice that because it's quite heavy over here it might it might not be a good fit like this because I'm using a 3 pin plug with an international adapter so you might want to choose one that is suitable but at this moment uh, yeah let's do with it right now usually I, I believe most of the adapter will be on the flat surface but for this I am using a vertical adapter and right now yes it has gone up to 51 percent 52 percent in fact it's actually faster than i thought so the time now is let me show you the time 2 59 pm right now i'll stop this video and when it reaches 85 percent i will turn it on again so okay it's almost coming towards 85 percent if you can see from here and the time right now is 3 35 pm which is like i think half an hour or more slightly more so yeah it is not that slow and also not that fast but this is not a scientific way to to determine the charging speed but then again uh, i want to make it clear that well it was being charged i did not turn off the screen and i also did not work on the computer or on the laptop i just say run as it is and definitely there's some some activities in in uh, processing during this time so yeah so 336 85 percent and maybe some of you will be interested to know whether this charger will be hot or not as you can see i can use my hand to touch it it is warm slightly warmer than the usual but it is still okay to touch by bare hand and i have tried to charge two laptops because um, if you understand or if you have seen the the earlier video you sh you know that there's 100 watt port and another one is also a 100 watt port but i believe they are sharing the same output so when i use it on another laptop that is like a 
60, no, sorry, I think it's a 45 watt laptop. It actually shows on that laptop that it is on a slow charger. So I recommend that you only charge one laptop at a time and you can use the rest of the ports to charge maybe your, your iPad or your tablet or even your phones and etc. Yeah, that is about it on this GAN charger. If you have any question, do let me know. I can try to answer them as much as possible. In the meanwhile, take care, stay safe, and that's it. So this is how it looks like to charge four devices at a single time. And for your info, they are all charging okay.